Well, the furthest I got yesterday was uh, from my desk to the kettle about a dozen times, friends. So, uh, sorry not to post. I trust that the, uh, the longer piece on Malta Hilton gave you enough to chew on for a couple of days. But this morning I've got out again and uh, it's really gusty. My uh, phone camera is lodged between the branches of a beech tree in the Wandsdyke. You'll be glad to know that's where you're situated. And, uh, and I'm just trying to get out of the wind so that um, you can hear a little something at least from me today. Uh, the Wandsdyke is one of my favorite spots. It's dug out like a, a groove on a lino cut out of the land, plowed out of the earth hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years ago, maybe four, 500 AD, something like that, as a boundary between uh, Anglo-Saxon kingdoms or between those kingdoms and the Roman Empire. And uh, as I say, I'm just cowering, sat down in the leaf mold. <laughs> but I'm happy. It's been, it's been a really intensely busy week. And uh, if I've learned one lesson this week, it's that you can't outrun email. Uh, you can't beat it. It will always, it will always continue on like an ever rolling stream. And therefore, we have to inhabit a different kind of uh, approach to to time and the demands of work. We have to set our own pace according to the grace given to us and uh, lovely to get a bit of space out this morning. wonder what kind of week you're having. It's uh, a couple of days before Palm Sunday when we will um, begin that slow approach to Good Friday and to Easter Day. It is where the drama of the passion story around Jesus Christ intensifies. It's interesting that it's all very often been put into dramatic performance that story in so many ways Jesus Christ superstar backwards to through all kinds of there were some great films about the passion Jesus of Montreal you might know and um, all kinds of depictions throughout medieval uh, uh, times the passion plays the mystery plays because it is uh, intense drama and I think it is so because it asks us where we are in the cast um, that is what part of its power is that the, the, the characters who uh, dissipate away from Jesus those who stay by him uh, those who react to his isolation in different ways some uh, angry and raging at the, the disappointment, others uh, uh, just grieving because of, 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 of their plans having apparently failed. It's a, it's a, a human drama and uh, we find ourselves caught up in it each Easter if we want to. So you might like to read a gospel next week and, uh, and consider it afresh for yourself. Um, got John's Gospel, chapters 18, 19, 20, uh, is, uh, is phenomenal. Um, and, uh, well, actually, from chapter 14 onwards, you might like to do, uh, which, which is the best place to begin over the weekend, as we, we start that approach uh, to the Last Supper and the, what's called the Farewell Discourses of Jesus and then the events of his, uh, his cross and resurrection. However, I'm going to just go back very briefly um, to the Psalms um, this morning because one of the, the gifts this week was to read Psalm 85. I'm sure I've read it many times before, but it, it hadn't struck me in the same way before. And I, it was a really, it's a really going to ground Psalm, this one. So I thought I might just read you uh, a little bit of it. The psalmist writes, Wilt thou not turn again and quicken us, that thy people may rejoice in thee? Show us thy mercy, Lord, and grant us thy salvation. 
I will hearken what the Lord God will say concerning me, for he shall speak peace unto his people, and to his saints that they turn not again. For his salvation is nigh them that fear him, that glory may dwell in our land. Mercy and truth are met together, righteousness and peace have kissed each other. Truth shall flourish out of the earth, that's the verse. Truth shall flourish out of the earth, and righteousness hath looked down from heaven. Yea, the Lord shall show loving kindness, and our land shall show its increase, or give her increase. Righteousness shall go before him, and he shall direct his going in the way. Whatever is your patch of earth, may truth flourish from it. And I'm going to stop here because it's starting to rain. And uh, God bless you as you go to ground.